This is Morgan. The year is 2035. Please listen. Hey guys, it's Stormerblade, and welcome back to another Friday video where today we're playing a little bit of an older game, but it is called Prey. This game released, I believe, in 2017. Editor, correct me if I'm wrong. And it's about this survival horror game out in space where you're on a spaceship that's been attacked and conquered by aliens so i'm super excited to kind of see what's up with this my editor suggested it so shout out to my editor and before i get on into it i want to quickly ask you all to subscribe down below help me get to a thousand subscribers before the end of may because if i hit a thousand subscribers before the end of may i will play fortnite for the very first time and also i released a very important video on my channel you can watch it right up here. Ah, first try. Right up here. It is the story of my life, aka the story of Drummer Blade. I really suggest you guys check it out. My editor and I spent a really long time working on it, and we would love for you to go ahead and watch it. So don't forget to subscribe, watch the video, and enjoy this one. This is me attempting to play Prey. Oh, I need to choose a character. <laughs> Go with a guy. You wake up in your apartment in the year 2032. It's not too far off, actually. Oh, come on. Some good music. All right, so, oh, uh, second climb. Can I crouch? So that's run. And take stuff. So, so I'd like to take everything. I will use this over where, oh. Oh, it's just too heavy, I guess, okay. I'll grab my suit soon. Uh sure, I'll take I'll take Alright. Now I'm drunk. Uh what's in here? Hello. Toilet paper. Uh, yeah. That should work. Nice. Put on the suit. Nice. Leather. Okay. Here we go. Roof access where the chopper is. Nice. Chopper. All right. All right, here we go. Oh, that's a spacious helicopter, dang. Mr. You, please make yourself comfortable. Nice. Transtar facility is just a short hop. 78 degrees, clear skies all the way. That's it, uh, Softworks presents. Can't tell what's a company logo and what's not. That's a nice view on the bay there. 
That's awesome. Very, very nice introduction. All right. It's going to be good. Here we are, Mr. Yu. Mind the glass on the way out. Good luck to you. Just Welcome, Morgan Yu. You have a 9 a.m. appointment in the testing facility. I know, that's why I'm here. Yes. Morgan. Hello. Hey. You don't look terrible in a transfer uniform. How's your eye? Still red? I know the test might seem a little unprofessional, but it's a few family tradition. Breaking convention is an awful life. Once you start the test, just do whatever comes natural. Okay. Don't overthink it. Dr. Bellamy is going to walk you through the process. You're in good hands. Sounds solid. All right, let's go. Already sitting. Wonderful job. Take a look at the screen in front of you. I'm going to show you a series of questions. Pick the answer that makes the most sense to you. Okay. Press start on the screen when you're ready. All right, here we go. Oh, I need to press F, not the mouse clicker. Whenever you're ready, Morgan. You're planning a vacation. Go somewhere familiar you know you love, or try something new. There's a lot of places I would like to go to that I haven't gone to before, so I'm going to say new. You've been sentenced to death for your actions. How does that make you feel? Afraid? I don't know what will happen. Angry? No one has that right. Or C? Calm. It was worth it. Worth it to do what? I'm going to do calm. I'm kind of confused, though. It, it is. <clears throat> a runaway train. No way. A runaway train is bearing down on five people who are tied to the track. You can cause the train to switch tracks, but there is one person tied to the second track. Switch tracks? I can't believe this. A runaway train is bearing down on five people. You're standing on the platform next to an enormously fat man. Pushing him into the track would stop the train. I'm not going to do anything. Almost done. A runaway train is bearing down on five people. You could stop the train by jumping onto the track, but you would die. Chopping on the tracks. Wow. And impressed. Well done. Well done. We're nearly through. For this next part, I'm going to display an image. I want you to take a good look at it. In a moment, I'm going to ask you what... Uh... What's happened? Where's Tim Tim? Oh my gosh, dude. Alex, you're late. Wait 
sure they are. You have a problem. What if I walk in? You go out, sedate it, turn it off. Got no more worry. Got it. Good morning, Morgan. Today is Monday, March 15th, 2032. So correct me if I'm wrong. What? <sighs> so the clock is wrong. When it's saying Monday, March 15th, 2032, again. Well, I assume I'm probably going to need to grab as much as I can for supplies. I don't, I don't, I don't know what. The music, I don't like the music. Music is very disconcerting, to say the least. No, I don't want to carry. Are you freaking kidding me? No. I just want to search. I get jump scared super easily. Let me close that. The frick? Um, okay. So just saying how to use a wrench. Interesting. Fudge. Only I didn't say fudge.
experiment with different approaches to overcome challenges and enemies. You can get past the locked door by A, searching for the key card, B, finding an alternative path. That's a mimic. Okay. So I need to find the key card to start. Oh, so now I'm tired. Okay, so there's... Yeet. Okay, nothing. Just some... There it is. I couldn't tell you, but I heard something. So I'm, I'm, I'm obviously kept for some reason, and I seem to have failed just once, and I passed all the other times. I'm so confused. Okay. So it's like a neuro mod or something. Interesting. So something like that. So there's just some weird suspicious thing it seems like. Okay. All I want to do is find the key card. I don't want to look for a corpse right now. That is not on my list of friggin' things to do, people. Okay, now we're talking. The Transstar Glue Cannon disables and or immobilizes targets without harming them. It can be used as climbable platforms or stun them. Come on, come on. There we are. Ah, fudge. Reload. Reload, people. So I lose strength really quickly, it seems like. Medkit, medkit, where? Near med division. Here we are. Sweet. Uh, the Nero mod is a revolutionary trans star invention that allows you to learn new still skills and abilities. 
Press N to open your transcribe and navigate the Neuromod section. I need help, so I'm going to learn how to use my, uh, Neuromod. That's got to hurt. Ooh. Well, guys, I think I'm going to end this series here. It's a very interesting game, being sci-fi and, you know, your last part of civilization, or I suppose one of them, one of the last people of civilization. But it's really interesting, it's very intriguing. I look forward to getting into this a little bit more. So this is probably part one of maybe a two-part series or three-part series, depending how far I want to go into this game. So I don't know how long I'm going to do this for, but very, very cool, fun game. Really enjoying this so far, amazing graphics. But yeah, so guys, that'll be it for today. Don't forget to subscribe down below. Hit that notification bell so then you get notified whenever I upload new videos. And don't forget to check out this video right up here. Would really appreciate it if you checked it out. Have a great day, guys. I'll see you guys in another video. Later. Mm -hmm.